Kathy Stetson is the technology teacher and she purchased the Cricut a few months ago for students to use. She purchased the machine because it can be used for learning tools, making t-shirts, or making stickers in general. I was taught today how to make the New Hampshire sticker on Miss Stetson's door. So this year we acquired a new tool in our hack shack and it's been a really super successful um, tool. We have a couple letters missing, but students have been able to make all sorts of fun things and these are just left over. Students are allowed to add to the sticker wall during any free period they have. We um, have a variety of sticker material. This is, um, it's called vinyl, and we were fortunate that we have a parent in the district who donated a lot of the vinyl to us. They do car wraps, and um, so we're able to use this particular vinyl for our sticker. So we have a lot of different colors. Students are welcome to use any of the following paper below or bring in their own to create their own t-shirts or other creations. A favorite type of paper for most is the holographic paper. They do come in a variety of colors and they cost around 200 I think this one was $250, um, but I did choose pink, sorry. A computer and software is used to create button. your design and then send it to the Cricut in order to print your sticker. We'll put our material in here and we have a dial here that tells us what type of material that we're using the newer ones have that right in the software we feed it in it, we can cut it and we can pause it these are some of the um, clip art designs that I had gotten that are free for use off of um, Google images so this one we'll just look at this one for instance so this is New Hampshire Hall. Miss Stetson was teaching her Adobe class how to use Cricut, and most of them seemed extremely interested and wanted to try. So what have you made from the Cricut? Well, from Cricut, uh, I made a um, sticker for my grandmother for the front of her door at her old folks' home, and it has her name and her interests and a picture of my face, and she loves it. The project we are creating today was a bumper sticker for my car. It was a New Hampshire template that we got from the Cricut website, and we were making it into a holographic sticker. After the Cricut had printed our sticker, we needed to cut it out and then use certain tools in order to remove it from the vinyl paper. <laughs> So I'm going to take this and I'm going to peel it back and remove the negative space. In fact, you might want to stop this. Yeah, yeah. That? Oh, there was a little tiny we piece in here. Yeah. And there's a tiny piece in there. So I've got all like the connect to this side paper so that after when this we, we use transfer tape in order to put it onto Ms. Stetson's it laptop. Fall apart. So I'm going to put it over this is put it over this apple. Our final sticker was a success. Stetson hopes more students will be encouraged to use this machine.